you know, according to our menu, the, uh, Caps is uh, where Ponte Vedra meets Palatka. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, there's a, you know, a little bit for everybody here. You know, you can sit outside and drink beer and eat oysters, or you could come in and have a five-star dinner. Um, weather permitting, you know, if you get a nice spot out on the water, it's uh, especially around sunset, it's, it's not a experience that you will soon forget, that's for sure. Well, we'll start right here, I guess. This is our um, house-made biscuits. Uh, we've got some fig jam, some onion jam, some pork lardons going on there. Um, within the biscuits, you've got some uh, fresh grated Gruyere cheese, and uh, you know we, we use buttermilk, fresh buttermilk, Gustafson's Farm, only the good stuff, uh, whole. Um, our Spanish gamba salad, that was a little bit of a labor of love, because you know we gotta cook, cook off the orzo, that takes a little while, and uh, it's kind of an unlikely um, mix of things that go into it that, you know, you don't you don't often see you know a, a pasta and a and a salad mixed together. Um, Parmesan crab cakes. We now use only jumbo lump in there, um, so it's you know, about as good as it's going to get. Um, our ahi tuna over here. Tuna is always awesome. You know, we don't accept it unless it's uh, top grade. Um, Bernard's favorite, the um, mushroom croquettes. Starts with a mushroom duck cell, some um, grated truffles, truffle oil, um, also um, Gruyere cheese, Parmesan cheese. Um, it's really a, a, one of his personal favorites for sure. Our cheese plate um, in there, I believe we have Manchego cheese, which is a Spanish white cheese. Right here you have Old Amsterdam, which is an aged Gouda. Cambazola, which is a mix between Gorgonzola and Camembert. Gorgonzola is like a blue cheese and camembert is more along the lines of a brie. Uh, our fig, um, the heck, uh, fig cake, sorry. We've got uh, almonds in there and uh, pureed figs. That's a specialty product um, we bring in. I believe it's made in England or something like that. It's, it's shipped over from somewhere in the UK. Our um, kale salad there. Um, another kind of an unlikely dish, all of the cabbage and kale and parsley is all kind of ground up and grated together. Um, some grated peanuts in there, um, craisins, um, definitely a um, superfood salad. Um, black and grouper, let's top with our green tomato jam, which is uh, being that we have a lot of leftover green tomatoes after making our um, fried green tomatoes. we utilize you know all of our product whenever possible so we take all everything that's left over and we make a jam with it um, we know about our sweet tea chicken it's marinated for uh, um, no less than 24 no more than 48 hours in uh, house brewed sweet tea um, and then we sous vide it for up to two hours and seared off on the flat top sits over a bed of chow chow which is a southern style pickled vegetable mixture um, one of my personal favorites right there. Our seared grouper, sitting over vegetable orzo with wilted spinach, red tomato jam. It's a really solid dish there. One of our, <coughs> oh, sorry. One of our best sellers and uh, longest standing menu items is she crab soup. One of my personal favorites. I always uh, suggest to customers to get when they come in as the she crab. Um, ours is the best, hands down. <laughs>